Okay, guys. I'm here at the Sphinx on a private visit. And so I'm going to climb and take a small little peek here at the secret passageway. The Sphinx. So that's that secret passage behind the Sphinx, and I'll walk around and show you one more. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I get a read more on the cases stuff. That's really interesting. Well, like I think you talked about technology existing in the records, but there's three sets of records. Is walk around yeah, to the other side. Yes, that Zawi was And show you another entrance here at the back. So at the side of the Sphinx's faces are two connecting spots, which is where a false beard was placed. Half is now in the Cairo Museum in Egypt, and the other half is in the British Museum. Okay. Let's show you now that we can sort of have a bit better uh, view. Well, the light lighting isn't the best at the moment. And this is the other. And this is the. No, it isn't. <laughs> this is the other entryway. The whole of records, H O L E. That's under the right floor, isn't it? The whole of records. Whole of records. <laughs> what the heck? Yeah. Now, you, you're starting to sound like yeah, Hugh. You said. Hmm? You're starting to sound like Hugh. Whole of I records. I think it's. Uh, I've been sitting near him for two weeks. Exactly. It really is the whole of records. I can see one by the Great Caruso. Well, they have a documentary for Dr. Zahi down here, yeah. but they just like, they don't show anything, basically. It's like, here we are Thank going, that's pretty clear. It's like, it didn't, it, but we had one Behind crazy the guest once who jumped in there and he almost went to jail, so I recommend it. Yeah. There's the other entrance and behind He deleted the photos dreams, and then he recovered really? the photos and he showed us the photos and it was like full of scaffolding and there is silt. The silt might be part of what was coming was the flood, so the flood maybe used to come here and cover the entire. Well, what's what, about, uh, the what about the opening behind the dream stele? claims there's nothing older than 2800 BC, and throughout the chambers and okay. things within the thing. Who? Who should? Yeah. <laughs> <It's> complete. <laughs> know, but nobody's allowed to actually go in there. And I am, I'm not outside. official, and I'm allowed. And you are allowed, and you are allowed. We all have the freedom to think. If you think everything is figured out, how was the pyramid built? Ask any academic. 
Do you know how was the pyramid built? Yes! Ramps and ropes. Huh? Yeah, right. Ramps huh? and ropes. Yeah. <laughs> then, then comes the subject of the lost yeah. technology. A quarter mile long. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> they cannot deny it. And they don't know where it came from. Yeah. So behind the dream staler, that little opening. I saw pictures. Yeah, I just stuck my head up and just did my camera and yeah. like. But sometimes these parts are, are made yeah. so they can re like uh, reshape things like to house a statue that will hold the beard later. We don't know if it extends all the way back. Mm -hmm. Here we can see the old one of the old examples of archaeology work, which was done by or during the time of Tut Moses. These are the mud brick walls that survived at least 3,000 years, these mud break walls. Wow. And they found the print of, and this other one also in the back. So after he revealed, he raised this mud break walls so it would prevent the sand from coming in again and again. Okay. These are very old renovations. Uh-oh. Yes, I think be aware that we have a minder following us and they will be watching everything, so minder? that's what I'll call it. <laughs> there you are, there you is, and your pretty pink hat. So we have a, somebody following us around, so we don't really want to get in too much trouble here. I'm sorry about the light at the moment, but I know it isn't quite the best. Oh, look at this beautiful creature. Did you pay to get in? Where's your ticket? Where's your ticket, you gorgeous creature? Look at you, sweet thing. Laxing and everything. Oh my gosh, I'm filming and completely just... Oh, God. dang it. Stop making fun of me. Well, y'all that are gonna watch the video, you understand. So if you saw that cute little creature, you would you would do too. You would sing to it. This is a Sphinx temple that we're not really supposed to ever go inside for some reason. 
But you can see the tall partitions there, which are interesting. And over there in the distance, the background is uh, the Valley Temple. And so down here you can see some granite blocks, some strange cutouts, different different things. Um, interesting, interesting stuff here. So I have been trying to get into here. But never, never, never will I be allowed. And there is that beautiful Sphinx. Thank you guys.